Good evening and welcome to live streaming worship here at Emmanuel Episcopal Church. My name is Father David Bumstead, the rector here. Great to be with you over the internet this Friday in the 20th week after Pentecost. Uh, tonight, you know, it's a really nice night out and uh, you've been very faithful in your prayers. If you want to if you want to pray through the Great Litany on your own tonight, please go and do so with my blessing. But tonight, uh, why don't we just pray Compline and enjoy uh, what God has given us in this evening. So uh, turn to page 127, join me for an order for Compline and a prayer book, and then we'll go off into our Friday evenings. Sound good to you? Sounds good to me. All right, let's go pray. Lord Almighty, grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty, our, Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault in thought and word and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive us all our offenses and grant that we may serve you in newness of life, to the glory of your name. Amen. Almighty God, have mercy on you. Forgive you all your sins through our Lord Jesus Christ. Strengthen you in all goodness and by the power of the Holy Spirit. Keep you in eternal life. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Let's say together Psalm 4 this evening. Answer me when I call, O God, defender of my cause. You set me free when I am hard-pressed. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. You mortals, how long will you dishonor my glory? How long will you worship dumb idols and run after false gods? Know that the Lord does wonders for the faithful. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Tremble then and do not sin. Speak to your heart in silence upon your bed. Offer the appointed sacrifices and put your trust in the Lord. Many are saying, Oh, that we might see better times. Lift up the light of your countenance upon us, O Lord. You have put gladness in my heart more than when grain and wine and oil increase. I lie down in peace. At once I fall asleep, for only you, Lord, make me dwell in safety. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Be sober, be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. Resist him, firm in your faith. Thanks be to God. On page 132, Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Be our light in the darkness, O Lord, and in your great mercy defend us from all perils and dangers of this night. For the love of your only Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. On page 134, say with me, keep watch. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night, and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ. Give rest to the weary, bless the dying, soothe the suffering, pity the afflicted, shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake. Amen. 
Now in lieu of the great litany is a good time for us to just spend a couple of seconds in intentional silent prayer. If you have any intercessions, thanksgivings that you'd like to share, uh, please put those in the comments below this video. Otherwise, I pray that you uh, will join me in uh, inter interceding for others and giving thanks for what God has given us today. Pray for my friend Caitlin, who had successful surgery today. Pray for the repose of the soul of Carvita Wilson this day. For Sean, Sherry's brother. We give you thanks, O oh God, for all of the blessings you've given to us today. Pray for all those who suffer as a result of coronavirus. Pray for those who are entrusted with their care, doctors, nurses, medical professionals. We pray for all teachers, students, and staff at schools and institutes of learning, especially praying for the Audubon Park School and for afternoons at Emmanuel. Pray for those that are jobless or have had their livelihoods compromised by the virus. We pray for all that have died, especially those that have died as a result of the virus. May light perpetual shine upon them. Amen. Let's conclude with Nunc Dimittis. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, you now have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations, and the glory of thy people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The peace of God, which passes all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God, and of his Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be upon you and remain with you always. Amen. Well, thanks for joining me tonight. I pray that you all have a lovely Friday evening. And, um, you know, don't forget to join us, of course, uh, for Sunday services at 8 a.m., 10, 15 a.m., 5 p.m., and 7 p.m. Of course, we'll meet here in the church at 8 and 10, 15, and we'll sing Evensong here, uh, streaming only at 5, and, of course, join with uh, our friends in the Nunezes for some trivia and Compline at 7. All right, have a great weekend. See you Sunday.